This artwork is inspired by horses and the relationships that people have with horses. I'm artist Liam Benson and I'm an interdisciplinary artist working in textiles, photography, performance and I also work with community. For the Bellroom Commission, I've created a work called Hello, Good to Meet You, which is based on the loose translation of the sound that horses make when they're greeting a friend or when they're happy to see you. So the Bellroom is an art commission facilitated by the MCA and it is a tactile, inclusive and um, interactive artwork, an artwork that you can touch, an artwork that you can play with. I wanted to make something that was directly, you know, coming from a long, a living passion within me. Horses have been an important animal to me for most of my life. I remember the horses being around me, my sister's horses being around me when I was a child. It was always about just being around horses. Um, my sister used to sit with me and teach me how to draw horses. I think it was one of the first things that I ever drew um, over and over again, almost obsessively. And um, one of the first things that I ever remember making were horse tails and horse manes, or large long tassels made out of leftover um, wool. It's making these kind of colorful combinations and playing with the tactility. So I've spent time out at Tall Timbers, which is a writing centre as part of writing for the disabled. Uh, and I worked with the community there, volunteering, caring for the horses, participating in uh, riding classes with people of all ages and needs to learn more about horses and the language that they use and what it means to have a deep connection with a horse. So Riding for Disabled is an association across Australia that supports engagement with horses and connections as well between horses and people but also people in general. It's a space that I've really enjoyed working in and learning about you know, how do the coaches there use horses to bring out and support people's development and confidence in the same way that we're using contemporary art to bring out people's stories, to build connections between people. And so uh, I'm touching on those uh, points of empathy um, and a mutual understanding uh, and appreciation and also love between uh, horses and humans. I'm excited about visitors coming into this room and feeling safe and calm and welcome. Like the title suggests, hello, good to meet you. This is a place where I want people to feel like they, they can find an immediate connection. So the first thing that greets you is a spectrum of colour. And there is all tones, all colours uh, here, from fluorescence to earth tones to our primary colours. And it's almost like an embracing uh, set of arms reaching out towards you. And then after relaxing in this space, there is a film that was uh, of the horses from Tall Timbers. These beautiful, gentle, considerate horses that um, know humans very well. The film has been made by videographers Vera Hong and Craig Bender. And they went in with great sensitivity and were able to catch such beautiful moments with the horses. People can also listen to the sounds of the birds uh, from, from the area, from Box Hill. Uh, we've got all sorts of both native and introduced birds. There's a black cockatoo that, uh, or a couple of black cockatoos that flew overhead that morning. And these are all the kind of local animals, the animals that, have, um, that live beside the horses. These are all things that people can explore and notice um, through using the different senses in this space. Then finally, if they feel like it and feel inspired, um, there are wearables that they can try on. And movement is something that we're looking at through the film, which is in slow motion. Subtle movement, also great large gestures and movement that we use to communicate.
I've also worked with a uh, Western Sydney-based composer, George Tillinakis. He's created an album with a series of songs that we can use to put on the wearables and go out and dance and play with movement. So these wearables hopefully will um, activate people and the people will activate the materials through their own movement whatever movement might be right for you in this space. And then finally, uh, to tie it all together, is the element of folk. This idea of sharing a process, sharing a passion, sharing a conversation, and also dancing together uh, whilst talking about all those things and what comes out of that. So I'm really excited to see what people, how they will respond, and then how those responses will then nurture and encourage other people to respond in their own way as well. And it's really, it's a process that's alive, it's living, and I want it to, you know, this is a starting point, but I want what people come and bring here to be the thing that continues it and uh, so that it's an ongoing process.